Hey, you guys, it's Tanya. Hey, this is Camille. I know you're probably like, wait, who is that? That's not Narika. No, it's not Narika. Nope. This is Camille, and the reason why I have Camille on the channel today is because... I'm from CC's Natural. She is, you guys. And you're probably like, what is CC's Natural? I'm going to tell you. Um, Camille, when did you start this company? I started back in September. Okay. As a matter of fact, right. we opened Labor Day week. Was it Labor okay. Day weekend? Labor Day? September? I think, I think it was. Yeah, Labor Day weekend. So I heard about your products through Narika. And in case you guys want to know, that's Narika D on YouTube, mm -hmm. um, which usually everybody who's friends who follows me on YouTube follows, follows Narika and vice versa. So it's pretty good. Or maybe not vice versa. But anyway, um, moving on. Focus, Tanya. So... Noriko was telling me about these products, and I was very excited to try them because, again, you know I love trying new products. And so when I went on your website, which is www.ccsnatural.com, um, I found something called Camille's Favorites. Mm -hmm. Now, what Camille's Favorites consist of are, what's it, one, two, three, four, five, six items. Right. And I bought some extra things, too. So I'm going to show you guys. First, we're going to start off with the... Um, <laughs> That would be Sorry. someone's phone, <laughs> not mine. So we're going to start off with the bath and, I guess you say bath and body stuff first, and then okay. we're going to move on to the hair stuff. Okay. So the first thing I want to show you guys is this right here. <laughs> this is what's left of your coconut milk and honey soap. Coconut milk and honey soap. You guys, if you can't tell by the size of this, I absolutely love this soap. It smells so good. Now, what what all's in here? Because you get, milk. you you press this yourself, right? Right. Coconut milk. <laughs> you have honey, mm -hmm. shea butter, mango butter, saponified oils, and then you have a little bit of cinnamon in it. Okay. And you guys, it smells so good. And let me tell you about my issue with soap. Normally, I just use liquid like shower gels mm -hmm. because they leave a film on my skin. Right. This did not leave a film, but it left my skin feeling conditioned. Okay. So I, this is why I had to stop using this so I could have enough to show you for the product review. Um, yeah, this will be gone, I guarantee you, very soon after this video is done because I love the way this stuff smells and feels in my body. Um, the next thing, which I still just have a little bit left because I said it for you guys, is the um, peppermint bath, bath soak. Yeah, the bath bomb. Bath bomb, I'm sorry. Mine got crushed in the mail. But I was cool with that because I like to break it up anyway to sprinkle it in my bath water because I love taking baths. Right. So this stuff, it smells amazing. It smells like peppermint. Oh, my goodness gracious. And it just makes your skin feel extra conditioned. So this is awesome. And you get two to a bag. Yeah. And so this is probably one left or maybe a little bit under one because I think I've done two applications before this. The next thing is the sugar scrub. Okay. Now, you guys, this is, I can't really show you without spilling it, but it's a sugar scrub, and it smells like rose and tea tree. It smells really good. It reminds me of, like, a dessert, to be honest. I'm trying to picture what I smell, what this smells like to me, but it smells really good. I really like the smell because you know I don't like anything strong, so it's funny because I called Camille on her cell before we ordered, before I ordered the products to talk to her. And she already was warned by Narika how sens sen sensitive, sensitive I am. So we kind of discussed what I would like, and she thought this would be a good pick for yeah. me. And she's right. I really do like the smell. It's very light. Everything she has selected for me was very light because she just custom picked this for me because obviously I'm going to be doing a review on it. <laughs> so... It was like, but, let's do what's going to work. I didn't know whether you were going to do a review or not. No, you didn't. It was just one you of didn't. those. Because hey, I just wanted some products. I'm Tanya. I'm looking at your stuff. <laughs> it's true. It is true. Um, what do you think I would like? Right. And she, let me tell you guys, based on what Narika told her about me, which is why you got to have those besties out there, she picked a right combination for me, which I really appreciate. So the scrub the, the sugar scrub i really like and how much is this that is six dollars this is six dollars for eight ounces i mean you really can't go wrong with that and this is all natural ingredients okay you guys um so now we're gonna one more thing it's just like a little bonus this is the lip gloss i'm sorry lip balm and it's very smooth and as you can see it gives me a little bit of a shine so i do like that and i, I really like this product 
So, um, and how much is the balm? The balm is two dollars. Two dollars. This and is about a half, half, a, half, a half ounce. ounce. Yeah, half okay. ounce. So now we're gonna get into the hair products. And the first thing we're gonna talk about is the flax double double butter. This can be used in your hair or oh, your, your skin. Butter. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna show you. And I'm sorry, you guys. You know, once again, I'm using the cell phone, so the quality is not very good. But I'm gonna put my finger in there so you can see. It's very, it's, it's a whipped butter, so it's very light and creamy. See? But I, I like this. It's very nice. And I do use this on my skin. I could use it on my hair. I just don't just because I use it on my skin. Right. But I could definitely use this on my hair with no problems. All right. So, and what scents does this come in? That comes in a bunch of scents. Right now, we have coconut. Okay. No. We don't have coconut. We have chocolate, mint chocolate. We have pumpkin spice. Okay. We have Ooh, pumpkin spice. Um, vanilla bean. Okay. We have candy cane. The peppermint, which is gonna smell just like the candy cane. I promise yes. you, you guys. Um, we have lavender too, don't you? We do have lavender, and that's more of an essential oil. So if gotcha. you don't like a more of a if you don't like a scent, like if you don't like a strong smell, because essential oil give you that stronger kick. Gotcha. All right. The next thing we have is the hibiscus um, flaxseed gel. Flaxseed gel. Now, you guys, I have tried this, but I'm gonna tell you right now, I have very high porosity hair, so I need a lot of this for my hair. I love this product. And it does smell really good. Mm -hmm. But this is more for low porosity hair. I'm going to tell you that right now. If because you, it's a lighter gel. It is. It's a very light gel. It's good for, it's also good, like, if you're going to do this look. See how Camille has her hair slicked back into that single puff? This gel is very good for obtaining this look because it looks very natural and it's very light. Mm -hmm. I wish, again, we could catch this with the camera, but we can't. But it's very, like, her waves are very soft but still defined. This is great for that, okay? And, and that's when when I, when I did my hair, I did a single back, a single pullback puff, but I stopped my pullback right, right here and had the rest natural, and it looked really good. It's just that it took a whole lot for my hair in the back. So, but again, this does work, but I definitely recommend it for low porosity, but this is an awesome product. Um, the next thing, I am so fascinated by this, Camille. Okay. So this is what we're gonna focus on because it just makes me happy. First of all, let me go ahead and show you the label, okay? This is CC's Natural. And again, it's available at www.ccsnatural.com. And I, I just love the packaging here. It, it just really catches my eye. This is something that really catches my eye. I know you're like, what is that? Well, let me show you guys. Camille, what is this? That is a hair tea. A hair tea? Yes. What does that even mean? Okay, so what it what you do is it's more of a conditioning and more of a built-in benefits for your hair. So what you would do is you can get it in three different. Okay. I'll, I'll jump in. What do you mean built-in benefits for your hair? Because lavender gives it helps your scalp calm calm your scalp. That's right. Hibiscus that helps with strengthening your hair. Nettle helps strengthen your hair. Okay. And green tea also helps strengthen your hair. And all of those, all three of those actually help strengthen, grow, and condition. Wow, okay. So you're saying there's three ways to do this. What mm -hmm. are they? Three ways to do it. You can... Oh my gosh. That just smells, I'm sorry, it just smells so good. What? I, I can smell the lavender. Give me that, give me that. <laughs> so. <laughs> So what you do is you can take three tablespoons of this. You can brew three tablespoons in either your coffee pot. You can do it there and just let it filter out. Um, you can pour three tablespoons into your cup, your, uh, like a cup or a bowl, and then pour hot water on top of that. Let it seep for 15 minutes and then strain it. Or we also have what we do besides the jars. We have plastic jars, glass jars, and we have tea bags. Oh wow! So that's the, cute. So tea bags, um, you'll get the same amount. Uh huh. It's just five individual tea bags. And you would just do it like you would do regular tea. You'll do it like you do regular tea. So at that point, what we would probably like pour it after you put it like you're making tea. You just pour it in, in like a spray bottle. Spray you can it on pour your hair. It, you can pour it into a spray bottle okay. and spray it on your hair. You don't have to rinse it out. You can put it into an applicator bottle. 
and squirt it into your hair. Like I do with my pre, pre right, treatments. like like you do with your pre poos and okay. everything, and squirt it into your hair. Again, you don't have to rinse it out. Or you can take a bowl, which is kind of messy after a while. Uh -huh. You can take a bowl, put your head in the sink in the bowl, and then take another bowl and pour it in and keep transferring the bowl back and forth. Yeah, I think I would probably do the spray. Or the, the spray, applicator, yeah, the, those the are spray cool. bottle. It to me is more effective because you can spray it on, put it through, plait it up, and be done with it. Right. Whereas an applicator bottle, once you put the applicator in, then you got your bag all wet. No, you're right. You know, you guys, this is something I've never seen before. So this is why I wanted to show it to you because how cool is that? A hair tea. And like she said, the mixture is formulated by Camille to strengthen your hair. And you can actually use this, I would think, to massage into your scalp. Too, you can, and cool. it also helps with shedding. If you okay. have problems with a whole lot of shedding, that also helps with that too. Awesome. So again... This is something that you've got to at least try once, and it is called the happy, look, it's called the happy hair tea, all right? And then the last thing, in the video before this video, we're talking about um, New Year goals for 2013. I mentioned to you guys, I'm up here in the east where it's really cold and dry, and mm -hmm. I'm suffering from dry um, hair. dry hair, which has caused me to have fairy knots. It's increasing my amount of fairy knots and split ends. So about a couple of weeks ago, I realized this. And so what I've been doing every day, when I get, in bed, get up from bed in the morning, I am saturating my hair with water. And then what I've been doing is sealing my hair with, because I'm providing moisture by putting that water in my hair. But then you have to seal in that moisture with some kind of oil-based product. Right. I'm using, what is this? That is the hibiscus leave-in conditioner. I love this stuff, you guys. And it smells so good. Too. It does smell. I mean, it smells really good. And she did. It smells just like the the soap, which I love. And you can get this in different flavors. She has different scents and fragrances, shall I say. But what I just do, totally saturate my hair with water. I get about a finger full like that. Okay? You can see that. And then I emulsify that on both my hands. And then I work it through my entire hair. This stuff is great at conditioning, but it's also light enough to where I can do this more than once a day. So literally right now, because it's so cold up here and so dry, I am applying water to my hair one to three times a day as needed and sealing it every time with this. You know, you can, I'm sorry to cut in, but no, you no. can also use that as a lotion. I know you're right, but I don't because I want it on my hair. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in New York and all my, and everything is at home in Louisville, Kentucky, and even your stuff that mm -hmm. I ordered for Black Friday is at home in Louisville, yeah. Kentucky. So I'm trying to make this last as long as possible. And it, a little bit goes a long way, you guys. I mean, look at this. I've been using this since the first of the month. Yeah. And this is all I've used. But I use this, like I said, two or three times a day, and it's wonderful for sealing in the moisture. And it's light, and it smells good. It's not very perfumey, which, you know, I hate perfumey crap. Mm -hmm. It's wonderful. So I definitely, like I said, this was such a treat because Camille's here. I want you guys to meet her. And look, she's in my home. Well, my faux home because I'm in the hotel, obviously. But, but hey, this is home until you decide to move out. Yes. Well, not until until you let me move out. Mm -hmm. But um, so I want to share these with you guys because, I mean, how cool is that that two random people who know each other only through Twitter and That's true. You know, YouTube and Facebook through somebody else actually are in the same Literally three six, exits. Six degrees. Six degrees separation. Yep. So true. And we, I just happen to be in the same city, same time. When I live in Kentucky and you live in North Carolina. Now. Right. Because she was in San Diego. So how cool is that? But um, yeah, you guys, I just wanted to show you this. And again, wait, you know what I forgot? What'd you forget? Don't you have a Twitter channel? Yes, I do have Twitter. What's your, what's your, what's your um, handle on Twitter? At CC's Naturals. Okay, and do you have a Facebook page? I do. What is Facebook page? CC's Naturals. And if someone has any kind of questions and they want to just email you a question, where would they go? Um, I would say Camille at CC's Naturals. Camille at CC's Naturals. That's amazing. Do you have a YouTube page? I do have a page, uh -huh. but there's no nothing on it yet but Not we yet, will but we will start doing videos and everything okay. showing how the products are used and just mainly just talk about what's going on with the company okay. but that is cc naturals as well all right you guys so check out her line and again um i mean if i swear by it and Rika swears by it come on shouldn't you swear by it too 
<laughs> I'm done. <laughs> you guys take care. I'll talk to you next time. Bye. Say bye, Camille. Bye, Camille. <laughs> <laughs>